In this video, we will show you how to create video transcripts with Otter AI and captions for third-party YouTube videos with Amara. These are just some of the tools that can help you meet UCF's accessibility policy standards. Both applications provide free accounts that can produce a transcript text document. Additionally, you can create caption file using the Amara editor. These files can then be added to your online course. In certain situations, such as a lengthy video lecture or podcast, opting for a transcript text file can be a better resource for students than just captions alone. The Otter AI application offers a free account that produces a transcript document. To create a transcript in Otter AI, create an account and select the Import button. This will allow you to drag and drop an audio or video file on your computer to upload. Otter AI will automatically transcribe the file. Once a transcription has been created, click Go to Transcript. Click Edit to adjust the text, correct misspellings, or assign a speaker. When you are finished, click Done. If you are ready to export your file, click on the three-dot icon in the top right corner and select Export. If you are using Otter AI's free account, your option is a text file. The text can then be copied and pasted or uploaded in a Word document to web courses at UCF. If you have videos in your online course on YouTube that don't belong to you, but need to meet the accessibility policy, you can use the Amara application. To begin, create an Amara account. Select Add Videos. Copy the YouTube link of the video that needs captioning and paste it into the URL text box. Select the language spoken in the video. For this example, we will select English. Then click on the Add to Amara Public button. Select the Add Edit Subtitles button to start creating captions. Find and select the language of the new captions and click Add. The Amara Editor should open. The main keyboard controls are displayed on the upper left. Click the More Commands to see additional controls. These shortcuts can be a valuable time saver while editing. Click on the Tab key to start and stop the video. To go back, click on the Shift and Tab key at the same time. Start typing along to the video. Keep captions to two lines at a time with logical line breaks. To break a line within the same caption section, click Shift and Enter at the same time. To start a new caption section, click Enter. If you need to take a break, click the Save Draft button in the top right corner before exiting. When you are finished adding captions, click the Yes Start Syncing button on the right side to sync your captions to the timing video. Syncing subtitles with the use of Amora's editor is easy, but it may take a few minutes to get familiar with the timing. Press Tab to play the video. Watch the black timeline under the video player as it scrolls to the left. Your current time position is indicated with a vertical red line. Press the arrow down key to start the caption section and arrow up to end. When the next subtitle must start, press arrow down again and repeat until the end of the video. You can also drag the vertical edges of captions on the timeline to change the start and end times as needed to sync up more precisely. After you've viewed your captions and timing and everything looks right, click Publish. Download your caption file by clicking on the download link. The VTT file type works better on mobile devices and is recommended for uploading to web courses at UCF. To upload your caption file to the video in web courses at UCF, navigate to the location where the video will be displayed. Use the Able Player app located under Tools in the Rich Content Editor. Paste the YouTube link, click Search for Captions, and select Upload Your Own. Browse and locate your caption file on your computer, then upload and embed. 
Your caption should now be displayed along with the video. Using Otter AI and Amara to create transcript and caption files are one of the many options you can use to produce captions for your videos that meet the UCF's accessibility policy standards. If you need more assistance with captioning videos, you can visit the Faculty Multimedia Center on campus or online at cdl.ucf.edu/fmc.